Hello everyone and welcome to Denomics. In this video I want to introduce you to the concept of flows within Denomics. Flows are a file type that allows you to specify an input, then specify a processing sequence, and then determine what type of data you would like to have returned. So there are many example use cases of flows out there, and in this video I'm just going to touch on a few of those in a very high level. And in subsequent videos that are available on the help page, you can see example use cases of flows. So when we look at this uh, example, we have points input where we are bringing points into our flow. We're then converting those points to a grid file, and then we're writing that grid file back to our project folder. So this, that's one simple case. Here's another case where I'm bringing in uh, points. In this case, my points would be deviation surveys. I'm processing those deviation surveys to where I will uh, take them in measure depth, inclination, and azimuth, and I will return the well bore in x, y, z coordinates. And then I'm going to write that those processed deviations back out. And here's an example where I'm bringing in logs. I'm then calculating a number of curves based on my petrophysics interpretation, and then I'm writing those out as a new log database. If we think about an operation like this, this may be something where I perform this operation over and over on every petrophysical project that I have. In this case, all I would do is I would keep this part of the flow exactly the same, and I would just update what database I want to use, what petrophysical interpretation I want to pull from, and then I would give it a unique name for writing those results out. And this is the power of flows, is you can set a flow up once, and then you can use it multiple times. And in doing so, you'll, you'll find that you can accelerate your workflows significantly. For example, if you were to use uh, Dynamics flows for log cleanups, you could set up a number of different processing steps where you bring in your logs, you'll add multiple tools here to process your logs and to clean those in a specific way. Do things like uh, handle curve name collisions, remove flat spots from the top or base of curves, do unit conversions, uh, rename curves or splice curves uh, based on certain attributes, and then write out a database uh, after all your cleaning has been done. And you may want to do this on every project you have before you bring that into your petrophysical interpretation. And flows is the way to do that consistently and to do that in a way where you know you can repeat it on every project. In the subsequent videos, we're going to go into specific examples on how to use different flow tools uh, to do things from generating reports to cleaning up your log data generating grids, and even running your own custom Python scripts within a flow. If you have any questions about when it's appropriate to use a flow, please contact us at support at And for more example flows, take a look at the video on our help page.